Good evening, Nashville, and welcome to Borough TV. I'm Evan Smith. And I'm Charity Burr. Borough TV is the student broadcast network of Hillsborough High School, and we're here to give you an inside look of all the remarkable things happening at our school. First on the rundown, it's one of the latest trends in education, and it's happening right here at Hillsborough High School. That's right, standards-based grading, and our very own Evan Smith, my co-anchor, has a story. The letters SBG have become an embedded piece of lingo across the Metro Nashville School District. Though different from traditional grading policies, some students are up to meeting the standard. Well, from my experience, I think that the standard-based grading is just to truly see if the students are learning and to see if they're really taking the time to know the information for themselves. The students might not like it right now because they're different. It's not they're just not playing school now. They have to actually really study. Teachers are still battling to get themselves and their students adjusted to the new initiative, but both students and educators feel that SBG promotes true growth. They are understanding why it's important to actually learn the content instead of just doing assignments. The assignments have more meaning for them. Also, just kids improving, also as people, just developing better study habits, developing better behaviors. With the implementation of the new grading policy, members of Hillsborough's administration have become pretty good at explaining the exact intentions of the change. We want to get back to two uh, major things. One is that grades actually uh, show or demonstrate a student's mastery of the content. And two, that um, teachers are actually only assessing the standards that are in the course content. Teachers say the biggest change they've seen has been the effort in students taking hold of their own education. We're having great conversations with the kids. It's no longer um, what's my grade in the class, it's how can I learn this standard. They understand that they have to know the content, therefore more of them are putting more effort into actually studying and asking questions. One thing it seems everyone can agree on is that standards-based grading is a change we won't regret. I think it's a pretty good move for the district because it really helps improve the students and I think the district as a whole. Thanks for giving me the interview for that story, Charity. No problem. Another benefit of standards-based grading is that it gives teachers more information on how to meet the needs of their students. Meanwhile, it's a story of only...